morning. It's a grey, slightly drizzly morning here in Glencoe. But it's about half past nine and I'm heading up to see if I can get up Curveridge today on Bucoletti more. Hoping that it's dried out enough by the time I get there. It's been, looks like it's rained quite a lot overnight. But it does look great already. So I've just walked in along the path. There's the water slide slab. And up there, the thin one in the middle is the Rannock wall. And to the left, that is Curve Ridge lurking in the mist. There's some people already on Curve Ridge. And I'll just come up from down over there. Mountain sweets. Delicious. So I've just come up the sort of big slippery step. Uh, yeah, over there. Anyway, that was, uh, that was quite intimidating with it being a little bit damp. Uh, I'd imagine that's a lot more fun when it's really dry. But the handholds are very, very good, which is lucky. Looks very atmospheric with everything emerging out of the cloud. Really good view of Rannoch Wall. It's hard to believe that there are some moderately easy rock climbs on there actually. Just looking at it, it looks terrifying. What a wall though, that is incredible. I'm on the summit 
of Bukaletev Moor. You can just about see evidence of that with the scenery creeping out of the mist behind me. Curved Ridge was amazing. Uh, I would have liked it a lot more if it hadn't been quite so wet. I think this is the wettest I've ever finished a scramble, uh, but it was lovely. Uh, I couldn't top out Crowbury Tower sadly because it was absolutely dripping in this thick fog. Uh, but that's all right, it's been a lovely morning. I'll go and see if I can get some more Munro's done. Oh, I've just stopped for a breather and the, uh, the clouds lifted a little bit. Oh, it looks beautiful. So there's the top of Stoddeg or Bukaletiv Moor. Well, technically it's all Bukaletiv Moor and that was the top of Stoddeg. And then just following the ridge across now, uh, you can see right down there to uh, the road into Glencoe. And then I'm heading up, this is called Stob Dory. Uh, and then there's a little bit more of an undulating ridge to get to the next Munro. There's the final summit of the day. Here's the view from the top of the second one row at the end of the collective Moor. There's the view back along the ridge. The clouds just lifted off of all of the tops, which is pretty perfect timing. Oh, I'm on the descent from the Buckle and it is very, very hot and very, very sweaty and very steep. And it's still a really, 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 really long way to go. Uh, Check this out. I'm on the home straight now, so I've managed to come down, uh, down there. It's, that took a long time, but it's very pretty. There were some nice waterfalls along the way, nice little river to cross at the end. Uh, and now I think it's a couple of kilometres, fairly flattish, but very nice path slog back to the car. It's been an excellent day. Uh, Curve Ridge was amazing. I'll definitely come back and do it again uh, when it's a bit drier. Uh, yeah, it's been lush. Crop! Smooth.